I'm your mystery reader this week. We are going to read Mrs. Smith in the Haunted Library since it's coming into spooky season. Zach stared out of the classroom window at the dreary fall morning as he waited for his favorite teacher to arrive. Suddenly, Miss Smith burst through the door. Good morning, class. We're going to visit the library today. There's someone special who I want you to meet. Zach smiled. When Miss Smith picked up the incredible storybook before heading out the door. Class, Miss Smith said, this is our librarian, Virginia Creeper. Zach stared in shock, blue hair, pale skin, deep, dark eyes. He hadn't been expecting this. Hello, Miss Creeper said in a high-pitched, squeaky voice. How can I help you today? This is the season for spooky stories. Do you have any suggestions? Miss Smith asked. Oh yes, the librarian replied, quite a few. I might find some of them in your incredible storybook. Miss Smith handed the book to Virginia Creeper. The librarian opened it and said, I'll just read a little from my favorite scary stories. Miss Creeper began to read about a dark haunted wood. Zach shivered. Then with a thunder of hooves, the headless horseman leaped out of the book. The children's mouths hung open in disbelief. Virginia Creeper started reading again, and the Hound of the Baskervilles pounced from the book. More reading added the clinking and rattling of the chains as Marley's ghost appeared. New stories brought out the Hunchback of Notre Dame, Frankenstein, and Count Dracula. The class started to cling to Miss Smith. The great black horse snorted and stomped his hooves. Frankenstein groaned, but, Miss, but Virginia Creeper just kept on reading as a flock of ghosts flew from the book. When Captain Hook and the Wicked Witch of the West entered the room, Zack wondered if he should run for the door. All right, boys and girls, we're going to pause there, and you have to check this book out to see how it ends.